When Mary and I filled out our five wishes, we were excited about communicating to each other and to our children how we wanted to be treated during times of serious illness and what we wanted them to know about our lives that they didn't know already. So we filled out each wish with a lot of care. When it came to wish two and the section dealing with life support treatment, which is often one of the most sensitive and difficult issues to resolve by individuals filling out five wishes, we were very clear and simple. We said we want the teachings of the Catholic Church followed on matters of life support treatment. But then we thought to ourselves, well, what are those teachings? Do we know them well? And will our kids know them well? Are we going to point them in the direction of big thick books and documents and pronouncements from the Vatican? Or is there a way that we can make it easier for them so that they know exactly how they can fulfill our wish to follow the teachings of the Catholic Church? So I spent six months studying the teachings of the Catholic Church on life support treatment and the important moral questions involved in end of life care. And that's where I came up with the document, Finishing Life Faithfully, A Guide for Catholics on End of Life Care. I think this document is a wonderful companion for Five Wishes because it helps inform your decision making on how you can be faithful during times of serious illness and so your loved ones can follow your wishes the way you would like them to be followed in a way that delights heaven. So I hope you find Finishing Life Faithfully a wonderful companion piece for Five Wishes and a great tool to help you communicate to your loved ones how you want to be cared for so that you too can go home to heaven with peace.